Hey Kiss Divas, it's Tracy and I'm here with a video. I know a lot of you guys were saying that you missed the hair discussion days, so they are back. We're going to discuss today basically an update on my hair, its length, and my wash day which was last night. This happened to be a friend of mine, but I promise her video was the easiest to understand and that was Shlinda 1. This is my current length because I know I've had my hair hidden and you guys know I cut it to bra strap so what I'm wearing right now is a flat twist with the bantu knot at the ends this is my first time ever trying it I was so nervous to take them down I did get help from YouTube videos but there was one in particular this is my first try I can't say that I'm completely happy with it at all I feel like it's very inconsistent this up here is what I was going for the twist out look the next time I want to try the perm rods on the end I'm trying to get all these different hairstyles down packed before I get more new growth that way as I transition I will be able to do these styles and you know blend my natural hair with my relaxed hair as I go I cut so much of my hair off and please don't take this the wrong way and I don't want to sound like oh whatever but you guys gotta remember how long my hair was and as of right now I am like bra strap length not not full bra strap length but grazing bra strap length so when I do this style and like when I did a braid out my braid out stopped like about right where this um, twist out is and I was like uh <laughs> where's my hair when I originally cut it you know I braided it up and threw a wig on so it was out of sight so now I'm really seeing the length gone and so that's a lot but anyways for my wash day the very first thing that I did was pre do like a pre uh, shampoo treatment on my hair and I took coconut oil and I keep it in this bottle you can get this bottle from Walmart or from Sally's I like to go to Sally's because sometimes I can find it at Walmart and sometimes I can't and I love this because it's so easy to get in your scalp and I go through my scalp and I massage it into my scalp the coconut oil and I pull it down the length of my hair and I tie it up wrap it up either do it overnight I didn't do it overnight this time I just put a heating cap on for like 15 to 20 minutes and then rinsed and then you then I shampoo so it's like a pre treatment that works so good because there's so many good things in coconut oil I will say if this is something that you're interested in doing make sure that you use virgin or unrefined coconut oil of course you guys I tried the dark and lovely products because I'm excited <laughs> So from the anti-breakage line, the All Naturel line, I used their Tension Release Hair Wash, which wasn't bad at all. Now, they sent me two of these shampoos. They actually didn't send me the conditioner, so I had to use the conditioner from their anti-shrinkage line called Not Out Conditioner. And this was my first time using it, of course, and I liked it. It really made, it literally took me a few minutes to detangle, even though I have you know new growth and stuff going on in it so the next thing I did for my leave-in is I used their super soft hair butter section of my hair when I was detangling in sections and put each put this on each section with the coconut oil over it to seal it and air dry when it air dried oh my goodness my hair was so soft it was amazing and not just my new growth but even my relaxed ends last for shine I just spritzed their Sheen Sealing Nectar and it's their anti-shrinkage line. If you guys see this in the store, grab this. This stuff is amazing. Like, I'm already going to go look for it. You guys know when I love something, I'm always scared of running out. This stuff is amazing. I'm not all that crazy about the smell, but it's made my hair feel so good. Oh my goodness, I love this. God bless you and I will see you in the next video. Bye.